Welcome to our podcast, where we explore fascinating stories and ideas from various fields. In this episode, we will talk about a robotic discovery that has unveiled a hidden world beneath the Antarctic ice sheets. An unmanned, submersible robot named RAN has offered scientists a sneak peek into the mysterious and never-known world existing beneath the Antarctic ice shelves, which have been melting in the wake of climate change. The robot, which has cutting-edge sonar, spent 27 days traveling underneath the Dotson ice shelf, which covers a wide expanse of 1,000 kilometers and reveals the never-before-seen details regarding these icy expanses. The Dotson ice shelf is an important place located in West Antarctica. They are not at all flat, but have passive expanses of ice shelves which keep evolving. They have thick bodies of glacial ice, which are sustained by land-based glaciers. What makes these ice shelves unique is the fact that they float at the top of the sea, and ice shelf cavities exist beneath them. In its recent mission, RAN focused on one cavity which unraveled new secrets regarding the melting patterns and structures of the ice shelves. The Dotson Ice Shelf also plays an important role in the overall stability of the West Antarctic Ice Sheet and how the sea levels will rise in future because of their size and location. In glacial exploration, it was found that the ice was melting faster where its base was eroded by strong underwater currents. However, the scientists were left stunned after finding the irregularity of the base itself. It was discovered that the surface beneath Antarctica is not smooth, but the underwater landscape is filled with peaks, valleys, plateaus and formations similar to sand dunes. According to the team, these features are likely to have been formed by flowing water under the influence of rotation of the Earth. By navigating the submersible into the cavity, we were able to get high-resolution maps of the ice underside. It's a bit like seeing the back of the moon for the first time, stated lead author Anna Wallin, professor of oceanography at the University of Gothenburg in Sweden. The researchers have decided to again carry out the survey and document any changes. This time, the team could carry out only one dive before the robot was lost beneath the ice. Although we got valuable data back, we did not get all we had hoped for, said Professor Wallin. Thanks for tuning into this incredible story. If this episode resonated with you, don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button for more captivating stories to come. Stay tuned.